phase three ups the challenge just a little bit. What I'm gonna ask Brendy to do is I'm gonna ask her to recall from this mat to this mat. Now, once again, doesn't look like much. They're really close to each other, but I'm telling you, you start to get a dog to go into motion from one spot, stationary, into another spot through motion and then stationary, it's the big enchilada. This is the whole thing. This is how you get dogs to move from all around your house, from spot to spot to spot, or recall to you, any other stuff like that. So let's take a look. Let's see if I can get her. We haven't done it. This is our first kind of uh, foray into it. Let's see how she responds to it. Brindy, come. Come. Good girl. Place. Good. Down. Down. I'm on the button. Dialing up a little bit. Down. Good girl. She wanted to get herself a little bit comfortable, so I stayed on the button, right? I said, Brindy, come. Pressed the button, held, gave her a little bit of information with my body language, moved her off there. She got to here. I said, place. She jumped on, and then I said, down. And if I would have been right on the money, I would have actually hit the button when I said, place over here. But I was a little bit behind, uh, behind the eight ball on it and didn't quite get on the button. But we'll do a few more, and we'll see how we do. Brindy, come. Come, good girl. Place, good. Sit, down. That's a good girl. Very nice, very nice. Let's do another one. Brindy, come. Good girl. Place, good. Sit, down. There we go, very nice. For the most part, what I'm looking to do is I'm looking to use pressure every time I'm asking her to do a command. So whether it's sit, down, recall, or place. She's feeling that pressure momentarily, and then once she commits to whatever it is, that pressure goes away. So a couple more reps, and we're gonna wrap up because this is looking pretty darn good. And she's getting sleepy. Brindy, come, come, come. That's a girl. Place, place, a little bit of body language. Good, sit, down. Dialing up a little bit, down. Good, and that's back to nine. So from six to nine. Very, very nice. So I'd say that that's a nice little beginning jaunt to show you guys how we move dogs from basically sit, down, place, and then using all of those together to get the dog to start moving from one spot to the other. Now, as we continue through the DVD, you're gonna see me start to use a long line, start to be further distances, start to ask more of the dog, and start to see the dog do more of the work on its own, which will be really the beginning of kind of the big stuff where the dog is actually doing recalls and, and sit and down without a lot of help. But uh, this is a nice foundational process. And if you stick with this and you work slow and you're really patient with your dog and you're really fair, you'll find yourself having some really awesome results with them just like this.